It all started with a Facebook post. It was out in the biker community, and suddenly we noticed shares and reposts. There were whispers, likes and comments. Could this really happen? Sunday came along, and it was a beautiful crisp morning. Chris's wife and son arrived, and with his beloved Triumph, which he had only managed to ride just once. After a quick chat and the trip down memory lane of all the bike trips and years of riding, it was time to get on his transport. The team helped Chris into the trike, and with close friends and family following behind, no one was quite expecting what happened next. When the biker community answers, it answers. Chris was taken on his final ride around Western Supermare, and the response was incredible. People who had seen the post lined the streets, clapping and cheering. At one point, the trail of bikes got to about half a mile along the seafront. They turned at Beerbeck Pier and headed back to the same applause and cheering and soon the footage was flying all over social media. People still amazed at the scale. The trike, with the precious cargo, headed back to the hospice. It was a glorious ride. Each biker was invited to turn around and give a salute to Chris by a little engine roof. His wife later said, that she had not seen him smile like that for days. This morning we just think it was one of the best ever. He wanted to go and it was amazing, wasn't it? Yeah, I was so surprised that it worked. Yeah. I was just going to make a bike myself. Western Hospice Care would like to thank everyone for showing support on Sunday. It gives a massive thanks to the biker community who did more than just make a noise. They helped with a last wish for that from our hearts. Thank you. To see more about ways to donate and fundraising, please visit our website.